this is my favorite drink the drink that keeps me going even in cold season i have to take it cold <laughs> because it's too sweet to be taken warm thank you How are you guys? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the time that you'll get to watch this video. My name, my beautiful name is Bele Temere and welcome back to my channel. If you're watching this video without subscribing, please do subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you get notified when I post a video. I say this is just a recap for today. Sometimes you wake up and feel like you're just tired. Maybe doing vlogs, maybe going to work, maybe you, you just tired waiting on God, maybe you're waiting on God for a miracle, for a job, for a whatever, you're just tired. You are just like me! <laughs> okay, so, um, lately I've been feeling, I've not been consistent the way I used to be consistent when I started doing lifestyle vlogs. You remember when I started doing lifestyle, I a lot of interviews and just mixing a lot of content. But I told myself, I got to a point where I told myself, let me try lifestyle vlogs. So when I try, I started doing lifestyle vlogs, it was, I got to a point where I was uploading videos daily. Because I, I, I felt like this is going to work for me. But then, as a human being, like any other, in Africa, Ma'ali, unasema, ah, I'm tired. I've tried this enough and uh, I've already made like 10 videos, 10 lifestyle videos. Nothing is coming. Really? <laughs> then you go to YouTube, scroll and look for your favorite, maybe favorite um, content creators. This will just begin without a name. Unajua kuna wale content creators when you are Lianza when they had already they had a brand already from Instagram. Like, jina ni kubwa tayari. But we we, you're not a celeb, you're not anyone, you're not anything, you're just waiting. Ile siku nye mungu ata blow up one of your videos. You're just waiting. So, here we are at that point where you're just getting less views. But then, you just want to give up, but then you tell yourself, I am not going to give up. This same round, with God, I am not going to give up. So it has been happening. But then, when you watch different vlogs, the YouTube, and see where people have come from, then you tell yourself, I'm on the right track. I am on the right track. You know, it happens everywhere. It just happens everywhere, not only on YouTube. Maybe you are trying to build your business or your brand. Huh, at a, even when you're trying to build something, even companies won't believe in you. Eh, not everyone will believe in you. Like, maybe if you have like 10 people will believe in you when you're starting, then you're lucky. Because me, they believe in me. How for me. But when you have even 10 people who believe in you and who push you every day, you are lucky. You are lucky and you should thank God. So, that is what has been happening in my life. And I told myself, with God, I am not going to give up. I am not going to give up. Because one thing, I met a certain lady. I can call her, she's one of the top content creators in Kenya. Because I kikatu video leo, Ishafika like 100k views. Before the 24 hours issue, Ishafika 100k views. Then I, I, I was talking to her. Uh, telling her where I am right now, and she was telling me, Bella, don't give up. Your day is coming. I can because when I was doing interviews, when I was doing interviews, when I was doing interviews, um, my my YouTube uh, watch time and views in Kwachini. I'm on a pata, you have like 300 views, which is a trial. <laughs> I have like 300 views, which is a trial, but then we could watch time. You watch time, I think it could be 10 hours. You get frustrated because una una mini sasa people are not watching my videos. Mutu wana ingia kwa video maybe one second, two seconds, and a talker because ange kwa na watch kama, kama ni video 10 minutes, mutu wa watch yote. By the time wana watch watu sita, that is already one hour watch time. Six people for 10 minutes. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Whatever you watch 
10 minutes you take for six people that is already an hour but unapata unapata video ko 300 views hours of difficulty kumi how how you get frustrated you feel like you want to give up but then you just have to continue but then when i started doing lifestyle vlogs i, I realized that atakama views the 50 but it has a good watch time so even if any people want to know the details but i thank god because my watch time has really improved imagine i just started i recently started uh, vlogging lifestyle like uh so you come as 10 videos but i believe in repeater but as the repeater 20 videos came in the comments of lifestyle so far but then if you look at watch them since i started doing it's past 1000 hours that is why that that is god god's manifestation in my life <laughs> like una, una, mbia, una jambia, eh? This whole time that I've been wasting my time on YouTube, doing interviews, like in the hours difficult how it has been a hassle. But then I just recently started doing lifestyle. Now hours zishafika tao, one thousand hours of watch time. Nas as dem alisa three months, as dem alisa two months. Na kama ninganza kufanya lifestyle kitambo sasa si video zangu zinge kwa zime blow up shuali. Anyway, we, we, we just give up in uh, small, small things. Not because that uh, we want to give up. It's just because we become impatient, impatient. Impatient with life, impatient with everything. Sometimes we also try applying for jobs. You've applied for jobs. So many companies right now in Kenya have my CV. You've applied for jobs. You've tried online businesses. No one is buying. You've tried, you know, you've tried mpaka wa mwenye uki kachini ujite mkutano na unasema, eh, I have really tried. Honestly, God, I have tried. My time shall just be here now. My time shall be here because baby girl, I'm a choker who struggle. But then, you sit down, you have a sit down with yourself and tell yourself, if I give up, who is going to do what I've planned for myself? Who is going to do it for me? I want to go some... I, want, I have dream vacations. I have dream things that I just want to do. I have a dream car that I have to buy in future. I have a dream family. I want to take my, my, my kids to dream schools, international. Who is going to do that if I give up? And then you just tell yourself... Uh, we are not giving up. We are not giving up. Every time you wake up and you just feel like, ah, uh, this is not working. <laughs> this is not working. Tell yourself that you are not giving up. Irregardless, no matter how hard things are going to be. You know, me, I learned so many things. I've learned so many things from Andrew Kibe. I know these are people when you watch on our head, but me, I learn from them. Positively, though, I've learned from Andrew Kibe, I've learned from Akode, I've learned from uh, Shonarwa, I have learned from who else? I will tell you what I've learned from them. So that I'm just going to say, oh, this girl, I'm trying to plan it, I'm inspired. No, there are things that I learned from them. For instance, Andrew Kibe. Andrew Kibe has tried so many things and they have failed. I, I watched a, a recent vlog of him, not a recent, I don't know if it was around February, of him saying he tried business, he failed. He, uh, he tried politics, he failed. He was at some point a pastor or whatever. He also got into debt like a shikwa kiwa job. Kitukamahio. And you feel like. Mimi uh, tuni mejaribu kitu moja and I want to give up and people have tried people have been trying people have been trying since their 20s they're in their 40s they are still trying I have only tried for like 2 years I want to give up for God's sake what's wrong with me let's go to another person another person is uh, Akode I don't know what uh, what 
everybody has their own take on different things in life so this is my take i also respect your take i have learned that love is patient and kind and i've also learned that from the bible love is patient and kind love will still get you regardless love doesn't care of the type of person you are love doesn't care of you of who you are god is the one who will decide your destiny and not any human being get it ah there's this young girl that inspires me so much shonara i don't know about i i watched one of her videos maybe a year ago or two years ago i don't know but it's called vlog yake kitambo I think the Mbaba thing was just her brand that I am Saidia could come up, you know, but it was not like at his G she was doing. Anyway, hold your comments because everyone has their own, <laughs> has their own opinion. So I feel like Shonharua, Shonharua has also been through a lot. How with her sister, her sister Lynn, they have been through a lot and I've learned something with them. When they were trying to open a business in town, like a year ago, I think. Because I've watched like Shonara's all videos, every video, on repeat, on what, whatever, I've watched them. So, one day they were trying to open up a business and they were trying to keep it a secret for themselves. Because, because, one, well, to avoid negative energy because you don't you don't talk about your success because before they come out you know they were just trying to keep it a secret until they established it they have been hustling together okay what i'm trying to say is that people are coming out from from so many things people are trying to break generational curses people are trying to break the norm of the society people are trying to live life positively no matter what no matter what i can go to life here shonaro like sometimes back i'll say my at some point i'll say my vlog yake alianza kushipeke yake kwa 19 or 18 years paying her own rent i can job za promo nini nini Pay her own rent. And when you look at the success right now, Atakama, maybe they are Jafika, but they are somewhere in life. You just thank God for them and thank God that these people survived. These people never gave up in life. These people were so patient with the success. These people were consistent and pushing, you know. Despite the fact that others came to learn life, she could idea to grow whatever businesses or whatever nini. It doesn't matter, but the bottom line is they never give up. Yo, that is just something that I wanted to share with you guys. And uh, yeah, whenever you are feeling like you want to give up, just know. Look at these people in their 40s who are trying to achieve things in their 40s. And they began it maybe in their 20s. So probably they are taking like 20 years to achieve their dreams. To be where they want to be. Even a career. It's not easy to build a career. To say I may be media. Because I've been in media. And I'm in media. And I know what happens in media. For starters. Let's say media. You know in media. You will go through a lot of frustrations. Especially when you are nothing. You don't have a name yet. Where? Unless you have talent to speak for you. But then. You will struggle. Whether in job, in kwa job, career-wise, business, whatever you're trying to do, at some point you'll have to struggle because you don't have otherwise. You'll have to struggle for you to get to, to where you want to get. And you have to be patient, by the way. You have to be patient because everyone has been patient. Even our president, William Ruto. <laughs> Even our president, William Ruto, was patient. Uh, he went through a lot of humiliation during campaigns, but then... But then he had to be patient and achieve what he wanted to achieve. Even our, um, our former Prime Minister, Mr. Raila, uh, former Prime Minister, Honorable. Was it a Honorable? I don't know. Honorable Raila Amolo Odinga. 
he has been trying and he knows that he is going to achieve this no matter what so Rela Mitchell for how many years so long and he's going is going to achieve that he's going to achieve that probably so what makes you think that you just have to wake up today january said something and you expect it to be to maneuver and you expect it to make it december unless unless god is from your unless i, I don't know unless you really have god in your life like you, Anyway, when you don't have a bahati, others get luck, others get, get God's favor, works with them everywhere. Others get what? Yeah, when you don't have a favor, God's favor works with them everywhere. Kwa business, kwa job, kina mahali. Like the other guy who was trying to vie for Nairobi government, Nairobi governor. That guy who vied with Sakaja. I think that guy works with God's favor, maybe. Because, hey, and I lose his job and I pata him immediately, and I lose him and I pata him immediately. Other people are just like that, but to you, for us who have to work hard and to wait on God, let's do it. It's for our own benefit. So, guys, uh, that was just a talk for today. I decided to do that talk because I, I was also feeling like, yo, if uh, I don't make it anytime soon, I am going to quit. But we are not quitting anytime soon. With my orange juice, my orange Fanta orange here, just chilling, I don't think we are going to quit. This is my favorite drink, the drink that keeps me going. Even in cold season, I have to take it cold <laughs> because it's too sweet to be taken warm. I love this juice. I love this soda so much. If you are planning to visit me anytime soon, Come with a bottle of Fanta orange. Thank you. So I say uh, that it was my vlog for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you have watched to an end, you mean a lot to me. I love you. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much, guys.